This is part two. Technology helped the historian to find out the very important medicines to control the diseases. So here is the two illustrated from two historical examples. In 1945, the dropping of the atom bomb at Hiroshima and Nagasaki, both in Japan. More than 3,20,000 people died and much more than that number was injured or disabled. Again, in that very year, the penicillin was invented. The medicines saved millions of people's life from the jaws of death. So according to the history, the technology helped to control the diseases. A scientist always devotes himself to make things better for human beings in history and now also and that reality has been the aim of every scientist. From the earliest times, the scientists have always offered their services for the cause of humanity. Yet sometimes people have misused the power of science. Though eradicated today, smallpox was a terrible disease that took a heavy toll of human lives. The disease was terrible because it had no cure. The one affected by it was sure to die. In 1796, a young English doctor named Edward Jenner found a vaccination that prevented the disease. Vaccination is different from injection. In vaccination, the fluid of a disease is put into a scratch made in the body. This acts as a preventive to the disease. Today, vaccination against smallpox has been the basic medical service in all the countries of the world. Jenner's work was followed by Louis Pasteur of France. He was a great man of medicine. Louis Pasteur did various experiments and studied vastly. He came to the conclusion that microbes transmit diseases. Microbes are very small living creatures. Microbes are so small in size that these could be seen only through a microscope. Through microbes, diseases are transmitted from sufferers to healthy persons. Louis Pasteur discovered the medicine that is the antidote for the disease known as hydrophobia. This disease is caused due to the bite of a mad dog. Today, most of the people live a normal and healthy life. Diseases are cured today by medicines. But till the other day, a large number of people had died of unknown diseases. Many were crippled by incurable diseases. Alexander Fleming discovered penicillin in the early part of the present century. The discovery of penicillin brought a revolution in the world of medicines. With the help of penicillin, it has been possible to save many precious human lives. Similarly, the Bengali scientist Upendranath Brahmachari by name discovered a medicine for the treatment to Kalajar. Kalajar is a tropical disease which had taken many lives. Thus, it may be said that scientific researcher and discoveries have always been useful for mankind. Various diseases which had taken lives of millions of people either could be prevented or treated now. The medicines discovered by the scientists have saved the mankind from suffering. Smallpox, typhoid, plague, polio, etc. are no more incurable diseases. But the tax of the scientist is not yet over. They are now engaged in researches to cure the killer diseases like cancer, AIDS, COVID-19 or coronavirus, etc. So here are some assignments for you from page number 31, page number 31.